sprinting away from the 1200 metre marker and it's beckered off. They have lost many lengths when the starter set go. Beckered off very slow to begin. On the inside, Constantine Puccini is very quick in the early stages. They are followed by Reactive. The red blinkers of Royce Taxi with a good position. On the inside of that is Siphon. Then comes Parv. They're tracing about three lengths off the leader. They are followed by Mark Mike Khan. And then comes Missy Barber, Royce Power. And Beckerdoff's giving them seven, eight lengths start. As they move to just outside the 500 meter marker, Constantine Puccini, further back a Cypher, on the outside Reactive, and then comes Pav. They are followed by Royce Power. Towards the outside, Mark My Card, Beckett of God, six or seven lengths to make up. Getting to the 300 meter marker, Pav on the outside, Reactive. Towards the inside, Cypher and Puccini. Reactive comes home strongly, Puccini, Pav on the outside. They across the track, Reactive and down the inside, Puccini. They get to the line, very close, Puccini and Reactive. Very close, we'll wait for the judges to confirm that one. And Puccini is the winner. It's Puccini who just makes it home. Reactive number six will run into that. Racing will go to Pav. And the fourth place to Cypher. And then number 12, Royce Power. And they were followed by Son of Silver. As for Beckerdoff, perhaps we can just go back to the start after the slow mo replay for my producer, Denver. Uh, mark my card further back in the run. So Puccini probably just makes it home. That's number nine with the white cap for the Erasmus, Billy Jacobson, and uh, for Ashley de Klerk. And they fight on courageously, and they probably got up to win at number nine on the tote. That will show up at 30 rand a win. So let's just look at Stallgate number eight. Stallgate number eight, and there's Beckett off. The gates open and Bekadov just stands in the stalls and unfortunately that ended up the tote favourite. So thanks to Denver until the running of the fourth race, back to the studio. Well, of course, just telling me some uh, an, uh, exciting news for the gentleman on my right uh, called Ivan, who's uh, been an absolute stalwart at Yellowstone uh, for Kurs and Chris, uh, uh, Chris, Kurs, Chris Erasmus and Kurs de Klack. But uh, number nine, Puccini, has come through to notch up his fifth career win. And although, you know, he may be short of his best over this trip, he's come through to win well. But before we touch on his win, Ivan, you planning to get your trainer's license and it's all in the process now? Yeah, yeah. And let's hope uh, it comes through quickly. Uh, this, I will be very, very happy to get my license. Well, we wish you all the best with that, Ivan. Coming back to this horse, you had him well today? Yeah, we freshed him up a lot, a lot. Uh, working much, much lesser than we usually work him uh, for the sprint. Uh, and that's well, uh, what we're going to do further on keep him uh, fresh and he runs a very 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 good race uh, he's much much better f uh, over further 14 16 uh, we only hope today for a place that was marvelous well it's a bonus for you anything else from your side uh yeah i think uh serve inspiration in the last uh, with a draw a nice draw and i think she will run a top race she's very good on a day yeah yeah very good she's one of hoping two. today yeah yeah thanks for that Ivan. thanks Lovely. Let's get to Billy Jacobson in and uh, just being congratulated by the proud owner, Ashley de Klack. But uh, Billy, uh, you know, I'm, I've touched on it on Lent. You guys were informed about it. It's uh, the luck of the ballot when it comes to uh, rides in these races. And uh, you pulled a horse that you've delivered on. Yes, thanks. Um, you see, it's not all about uh, the jocks. If you get a chance, you can always arrive. Top guys get top rides. If we get a chance, we'll also show them. How's this, uh, the, this horse on, on paper? He looked to be maybe on the sharp side for him? He did look good on the sharp side. I know him from when I used to work for Yellow Star, and I know that he's got a lot of uh, speed, which I used his speed 
and I knew that he would just stay on at the end, which I went quite quickly in the beginning, and it paid off for me at the end. There was a fight on your hands, but he, he kept putting his head in front. Yeah, at one stage, about the 100, Warren came past me, and I thought, oh, this is it, and he really dug down deep, and he won a good race. Well, the points are yours in the first leg. You, you'll be the leader going into the uh, second leg, which is in four weeks' time. So well done to you, Billy. Oh, thanks. Uh, yeah, I heard there's a bit of prize money, so I'm itching, eh? I think it's 50K, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> I won it. <laughs> well played, Billy. And uh, big thanks to Ashley and um, the whole Declack uh, team, Yellow Star Stud. So nice to ride for them again. Um, I love them to bits. Thank you. Well done, Billy. Let's get uh, the proud owner in, Ashley de Klerk. They also 50,000 rand for the owner. So Ashley will be topping that board as well with her runner. But uh, Ashley, uh, this horse has done you proud again? Oh, again, I can't believe it. It's been absolutely phenomenal. And yeah, I just want to say thank you to Billy, Chris, Ivan, my parents. It's just great. I'm glad you touched on dad and mum because they're firmly part of this team at Yellow Star. And uh, Ivan uh, is planning to get his license as well. Yes, I must say we're all quite excited for him. And yeah, it's just fantastic. And well done to everyone, the whole team at home. Thank you. Well, this win certainly came at the right time after your trip to the World <laughs> Cup. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Did you enjoy it? Fabulous. Everyone should go. Well done, Ashley. Thank you. Lovely. Ashley de Klerk, uh, the proud owner of uh, Puccini, uh, number nine. And uh, if you caught this quartet, well done. It should uh, yield uh, uh, a handsome dividend here. Nine, six, eight, and seven. That's the way they cross the line. Race uh, number three. Well, uh, Zane's just telling me that we got the numbers wrong there. So it's uh, nine, six, seven, and eight. That's the best cameraman on course. Thanks to Zane. Coming up next will be the start of the jackpot. Race number four at 14.45, which is a quarter to three.